Hello, everybody. I am speaking uh, from the capital of Ukraine, Kyiv. My name is Yevhen. Why do they say the Ukraine already won? Now the Solidar town battle is in the focus of mass media. Prior to this, there were a lot of different informational accents and topics to which the attention of the international society was reverted. The largest ones can be called in the worst time order. Blackouts, nuclear blackmail, the atrocity of the Russian troops in the occupied territories, the hard artillery attack on the Donbass, rapid advance of the Russian army deep into the country. Each of the above-mentioned phases was overcome by the synergetic efforts of the Ukrainian people together with the people of the conscious democratic society of the whole world. If we talk about the rapid advance of Russian troops at the beginning of the war, then literally at the end of March it was severely broken and pushed far back to the borders of the Russia and Belarusia. If we are talking about nuclear blackmail, then Putin was silenced by the international community. If we mention the projectile advantage, Ukraine's military partners provided many weapons to the massive massively destroy Russian aggression on the territory of Ukraine and, if necessary, deep in the middle of Russia. If we are talking about an active missile company aimed at civilian infrastructure, then thanks to the heroic efforts of people and the strong material support of the West, Ukraine also withstood this phase with dignity. Now the contagion of totalitarianism has grown in the world. But a year ago, the main topic was COVID. If we draw a parallel and ask the question, has mankind defeated COVID? The answer is not quite yet. But in the minds of humanity, COVID was defeated when many countries and companies found a vaccine. And now there is no idea that humanity will die, although such an idea was seriously considered in the first half of 2020. Now the world has already defeated Russia by the hands of Ukrainians with the money and equipment of the collective democratic world. In all spheres, for the next 10 to 20 years, you can forget about any competitive ability of Russia. That's why everyone is already saying that Russia is defeated. Although its army is still energetically trying to do something on the territory of Ukraine. Thank you for listening.